Hi everyone, it's Doreen with Ooh La La Vintage Treasures and I have some pretty Etsy shop I want to share with you and this is Huckleberry Sky. I purchased from this wonderful lady Huckleberry Sky and she sent me a lot of beautiful things and I wanted to share them with you. So I did order the ruffle but I wanted to show you this how pretty it looks on here. Isn't that gorgeous, you guys? Oh, I love this. It is so soft and so pretty. I cannot wait to use this on one of my new wood boxes that I got for my rulers so I can put my rulers on display while I'm working on projects. So I got these to go on my wood boxes and I'll be sharing that in another video, but aren't these so pretty? I'm gonna make little snippets to go on the little ruffle and it's gonna go around a square box a square wooden box so love this so much Donna these are beautiful so that is one of the ruffles let me show you some more and then this is the paper so there's 25 sheets of tea dyed paper here in the back it's beautiful papers and then there's heavily tea dyed that's got more markings on it so those are the papers. Aren't they beautiful? I love looking at papers. So pretty. Yeah, so I just wrap the ruffle around here and I keep it in my craft space so I know who it comes from. So I know this is from Donna at Huckleberry Sky. So I'm just going to tie this up real quick. Okay, and then the next thing I got from her was these ruffles. I had already put this stuff away because I hadn't had time to film. So I have it in my little white containers that I, these drawers that I got from eBay a couple years ago now, I think. And I'm keeping a lot of my things in these um, sweet little cookie bags that are tea dyed. And it keeps them in there nice and neat. And as I need to use my products that I've purchased from Etsy, I have them right there um, on my table, in my desk. So, yeah. So let me go ahead and show you those. More ruffles here. And, oh, here's the whale tails that I got. They're just coffee dyed whale tails. Let me show you. I didn't realize he, how small these things are, but aren't they cute? Yeah, so those are really cute. I like those. I'll just put those back in the bag. And then here's the ruffles I just showed you on the paper. So Donna wasn't happy with her staining, so she sent me some more. I was completely happy with them, Donna. And um, I love how they look. So I'm not sure why she was disappointed in how they looked, but she wanted to send me another set to try out. So these are what she sent me here. And she sent me this one. And this is a lighter tone. I think these are gorgeous. Light, dark, I don't care. I like them all. <laughs> okay, so that's that one. And I'll show you what she sent me along with it in a second. Okay, so let me show you these real quick. So these are her paper ruffles. And I love paper ruffles. You know, guys, I've been showing you a lot of videos on paper ruffles. And I wanted to show you guys these. I have been wanting to get these from her for a while and so I finally ordered them and look at how cute they are I love these and she has a variety pack so you can get the um, the one with the book pages going down this way and then you can get this style where there's the book pages in the background which I love that so those are really pretty gorgeous I love how she has the light mixed with the dark pretty pretty it looks like she uses dictionary pages and all kinds of different types of book pages there. 
As you can see, there's different words, which is really nice. You could cut each individual um, ruffles out and you can, you know, use those like that. Or you could just use them on your project, which I love that. So that's one set. I probably won't put them back in cellophane. I'll just put them back in here now. For now. Okay, and then these right here. Ooh, these are so cute. Okay, so these are the other ones. See, I like them both ways. They're really cool. Very nice. So you get five of each in the set. I got a multi, I think it was called variety set. Let me see what this was called. This was called book paper and tea dyed paper ruffled. That's what that one was called. She sent me a note. Thank you, Doreen. Hope you love everything, Donna. Okay, and then she, I believe um, she sent me a goodie here. I didn't get a chance to really check it out. So I ordered these pockets. I thought they were so cool and gives me an idea on what I can make. And they're already stitched. You guys that know how to make these and stitch them, you know, this is probably easy for you, but this is not easy for me. So I like them. They're really cute. I love that they have little tuck spots here and here probably should have got a tag to show you let's see a tuck spot here and a tuck spot in here that's super cute and then this one is a tuck spot here and here so this is three tuck spots here and that's that one. This one's really cool. It's sideways and it's a tuck spot here and here. So that's really nice. And this one has like, you know, this and this. And they're all stitched. Did I show you this one? This one goes this way with a tuck spot here. And there. That's so cute. And then this is a bigger one. I believe this was called a variety pack too, where you get different ones and you could have a choice if you want a big or small or you know, mix sizes. So I got the mix size. I like this one. This one has a nice feel to it. Again, they're all stitched. And this one here just has one pocket here and one pocket here. Super cute. And they're stitched. So I love that. So thank you, Donna, for that. And then I believe these are extra because I didn't order this and I love the stitching on here oh my goodness this is so pretty look at the stitching I haven't looked at her site to see if she's selling these yet but I love this stitching wow that looks so pretty wow this is pretty too look at that can you guys see that I hold it up there. These are all coffee dyed papers too. Those are so nice. Thank you, Donna. Those are really nice. Okay. So let me get the crunchy paper out of the way here. And put these back in here. I probably need to put them in their own bag because really this is too full. Let me grab another bag here real quick. Oh my goodness, that was a lot of noise. Okay, so I'm going to put this one here and these in here so I can remember who they're from. I 
think I'll have them sticking out so I can see like that. I might have to tie something on there. But yeah, that's it. Those will fit really nice in my, my little container here. Put those in the back and put the ruffles in the front. Like that. That's super cute. Okay. And then she sent me a second order. I didn't say anything about the order, but she wanted to send me some more. So she sent me this note. Sorry this took so long. Wanted to send you some ruffles with a bit more staining variety. Also sending a few more samples of new paper ruffles and decorative stitch and French letter script. Isn't that gorgeous? Thanks for your patience, Donna. As you can see, I'll use any old thing as a note card. Haha, <laughs> that's so cute. I love that, Donna. That's really cute. So these are the other ruffles she sent me. Uh, let's see. I'm just going to rip it. Wow, you really sent me a lot. Those are so pretty. I don't know what was wrong with the last ones, Donna. These are beautiful too, but those were totally fine. Look at the staining on that, you guys. Oh, love it. These are so cute. I'm definitely going to use these on my, my square um, planner boxes that I got. Those are so cute. Love that. Wow, it's a lot of ruffles. So that is from Donna, as I told you. I'm just going to roll these up real quick and stick them in my little bag here. Wow, I got a lot of ruffles to play with, you guys. I cannot wait to get to play. After I finish doing my Kit Club kits, I'm going to get back to playing. I just need to do this video because it's already been a couple weeks and I haven't been able to do the video. And I'm going to save her card tucked back in here. Because I love saving my little cards. So that's really cute. Oops, I might have to fold your card, Donna. And I could use this paper too if I wanted to. But it looks so cute in here. I don't want to... I don't want to do that. So there we go. That's all full of ruffles now. And my cute little cookie bag. I love that. Okay. And then she sent me this. And she made this pocket. Isn't that cute? Look at this pocket. So clever. That is a really cool idea. Okay. And then here's some more paper ruffles. Oh boy. I have to fight the packaging. I better just cut it. Oh wow, these are really cool. I like these. Different papers and different inks that she put on her ruffles. I like the color differences. That's really nice. Very cool. I like that. Okay, so this will go in my paper ruffle box here. And still working on projects, so my my desk is a huge mess right now, you guys. Sorry about that. And I will be back with some I will be back with some happy mail. I'm so excited. I got a package and I can't wait to share it with you guys. So thank you guys so much for stopping by my channel. And I'll be back really soon with another video. All right. Bye, everyone.